To install the failover system, you'll follow the usual procedure. However, in this case, you'll select a different installation type that is failover server and client. After you've installed the failover system, access the supervisor's web page. When you connect to the supervisor for the first time, select the IP address of the required network interface. Then you are prompted to add IP addresses of other available servers on which the failover system has been installed. You can create various configurations from servers added to the same cluster. If you press the Next button without adding more servers, the system prompts you to initialize an isolated node that is to create a 1 plus 0 configuration. In the Configuration tab, the system lists the newly added server as an isolated node. To edit your configuration, click on the button. You can also shut the node down by clicking ellipsis. The Dashboard tab displays the node's operational status. 75% of CPU resources are allocated to the node's operation while 1% is used by the supervisor service. In the Configuration tab, you can back up your configuration and then restore a configuration from a previously saved backup. If required, you can restrict access to the supervisor web page in the users section. In the software version section, version numbers are displayed for the software itself, as well as detector pack and IP driver pack. The update section lets you update all servers within the cluster by specifying a file or a URL. If you select the Disband Cluster option, all previously selected computers will be removed from the cluster. Important, if you need to set another IP address for a server belonging to a cluster, disband the cluster and then add a server with a different IP address. Now let's start the Axon Next client. Please note that only one node is listed in the list of available connections since we have included only one server in our configuration. Specify a new domain name and click Apply. Click the Continue button. After the client software starts, Axon Next's standard settings interface will open. Setup is now finished.